Happy Friday. Vlogtober. Day six. with my head rest. What? This. I'm trying to see. Stop before you break it, Elijah. Sit back. So we're on our way to school. And I was just telling him that I saw his footage from the other day. So I'm going to let you hold it. Remember where to hold it. Talk. We're almost to school. We're almost to school. Gotta hold it out where they can see your face, Elijah. Now look up at your nose. There we go. So we're almost at your school. And today is color day. Today is color day, so I got on purple. Mhm. Mm hmm. Whose favorite color is purple? Mom. Yeah. You see that woman on the scary poster right there? They can't. Let me see. No, they can't. He's talking about that Erebus. Yeah, my city has, uh, it's supposed to be like the, one of the biggest haunted houses, so. Yeah, it's haunted. But we don't do haunted houses and stuff, do we? No. So. I'm scared of haunted houses. Mm hmm. They make me creep. Yeah. But, like, spooky, spooky things that go, like, Right. Like, terrifying. Mm. Terrifying. But when you have bad dreams, what are you supposed to say? Blood of Jesus. That's right. The blood of Jesus covers everything, right? Right. And you know, it's just a dream. It's just in your mind. Yeah. Okay. So, yeah, we're headed to school. Um, and then I got to go to therapy. It is a very gloomy, rainy day. So, you probably is, have indoor. What does gloomy mean? That just like. Yeah, kind of sad and dark and stuff like that. That's what gloomy means. Yeah, that's like where the like the cloud like disappears. Mm -hmm. Like, like it. No, those clouds here. They just the, you can't really see the sun because it's so cloudy and the clouds are all gray and stuff. Yeah. So yeah, that's. Uh, if it's fog, that means I can't see nobody. Yep. So that's where we're headed off to. Oh, mom! You see that big. Hills. Okay, we're about to go to school, right? Right. You're gonna have a good day? Right. And they're gonna have indoor recess because it's raining outside. And oh, Elijah has. we can have outside recess. No, it's raining. And Elijah has lost his oh, other. Wait, wait, wait. Dirty, dirty. Let it go. Elijah has lost his other um, jacket, the one with a hood on it. So, I gotta search the house and try to find that one because I don't know if he left for that school or what. So, we're gonna have a good day. Yes. Right? right? Gonna listen and follow directions? Yes. Yep. Gonna learn, 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 right? Right. right. I'm stuck. Tell the way you turn to you. See you later. I'll see you later. Bye. Bye. Alright, so I'm out of therapy. Uh, Just stopped and grabbed me some breakfast for me. Coney for you Michigan people. <laughs> you know what Coney's is. I'm at Pete's actually. Uh just got some toast, grits, and bacon. <laughs> uh, so I'm about to go home and eat that. I still have yet to fold this laundry. In my defense, I did do one one load. I just gotta do the rest of it. So I'm gonna do that after I eat breakfast. Um or sometime today. I don't know. I ain't about to lie. Ooh, ooh, Jesus. These potholes, it's not gonna work for me. Can I get out this way? I got a Jeep. I can get out this way. <sighs> so yeah, that's what I'm about to do. It is a rainy, rainy day. And y'all already know, 
rain does not make me feel well makes my head hurt so I'm gonna catch this headache before it gets really really bad um so I'm about to go eat breakfast take my medicine eat breakfast put on a movie and fold this laundry and I'm gonna try like I said today to um after Elijah gets out of school, maybe we can go bowling or do something. Uh, you turn in? Uh, a blinker would have been nice. Thank you so much. Gosh. Anyways, try to take him bowling or me and him do something tonight. Um, Because I need to do something, y'all. Be in this house all day. Yes, I did. Just run this yellow light. Oh, you ran the red light. That light was good and red and you ran it. So, <laughs> so that's what I'm about to do. I'll see y'all in a minute. Let me tell y'all something. I came home from therapy, right? And I ate breakfast. I took a nap. I don't remember what time I went to sleep, y'all. Let's just say I woke up and it was like 2.30. This dang rain to get you, boy. To get you. I'm like, when did I fall asleep? What? What? And I, you know, have you ever slept so hard and you wake up? And then you just sitting there in the bed or wherever, and you just like. That's how I was. I was trying to get my mind to wrap around what day it was, what time it was, what season is it, what year is it. I just, I didn't understand why I had slept so hard. And the only thing I can think of is that it was this dang rain. It was the rain. So, as always, I'm on my way to go get the kid. And then, um, I think my mama needs to go to Target. So, we're going to go to Target and then I got to go past Walmart. Because I need to go get Elijah's costume before I forget. And then they won't have any more. And I'm not trying to deal with him being devastated because he couldn't be Black Panther. So, yeah. That's what I'm going to do. <clears throat> And I probably need to eat again. Same as I only ate this morning at like 11. Yeah, that's going to be my next mission. Find the food. But I'm in traffic, so I'll see y'all. Alright, so I'm here. <clears throat> I had Elijah's school. It's so funny. Some days I can get here. And I'll be like a little farther back in the pickup line. And then some days I get here around the same time and then I'm like one of the first 10 cars in the line. And I'm like, I don't know. But every day, I think since last year, I come here and it's some parent, it's a car, one or two cars that be here like an hour before the kids get out. I'm like, do you not have nothing to do? You don't like naps? Because naps, naps are good even if you don't have anything to do. Naps, naps are awesome. So... But I mean, hey, maybe that's they part of their routine. That's what they want to do. So they do it. So I'm just sitting here, like I said, getting ready to get Elijah. Um, try to go bowling or do something. I know I promised him we'd go to Walmart and get that um that Lego movie. Excuse me, it's in like the five dollar bin. I think I said this previously, so he'll probably get that and don't care about anything else. We still have yet to find his tablet. I'm sure it's in the house somewhere. It may be in my auntie's house. I don't know. I need to text him and ask him. Because I can't remember if he took it, if he had it with him Sunday. It may be over there. But I feel like he had it throughout the week. I don't know, y'all. We'll find it. Um, I'm loving this haircut right now. Cause I don't have to do too much. Actually, I ain't do nothing to my hair. I ain't sprayed with no water. Did I spray with water? I ain't sprayed with no water. I can't remember if I did. I just got up and and got myself together and then got Elijah ready, which takes a whole another fifteen or so minutes. Cause he's so dramatic in the morning. So whatever. But I'm sitting here. I'm about to finish. Uh, well, start back and read my book. I haven't read it in a few days. Which is, I feel like I've talked about this before. The weight. 
by Devon and uh, Devon Franklin and Megan Good Franklin because that woman married because her last name is Franklin. You know, she keeps her last name because uh, of she's a you know movie star. But yes, it is an amazing book. Like I said, it's about uh, it says a powerful practice for finding the love of your life and the life you love. It's not just about being celibate and all that stuff, but it's an amazing book. And at first, it, I was like, oh, I don't want to read it. You know, you know, the enemy be whispering in your ear like, girl, you don't need to read that. Don't read that. Mm -mm. That's how I feel like the enemy talks sometimes, depending on certain things. And be like, mm -mm, girl, you, you don't need to read that. Don't read it. But I was like, you know what? I'm going to read it. And every time I read more, he's like, ah, ah, ah. and then he just finally backed up. And I am on chapter, I want to say chapter four, three or four. I don't know. Do it even have chapters? Yeah. Yeah, I'm on page 71. So that would be in chapter 3. I'm in chapter 3. So I'm about to get back to reading that. And then I'm going to wait for the kid to get out. So I'll see y'all when he gets in the car. Okay, bye. So what's up, guys? So my friend, my sister, has drugged me out the house. I told her she knows that I love her because I put a bra back on to come out the house because I was pretty much in night clothes. But yes, I'm here with my sister Janila and her sister Coretta. And it's Coretta's birthday. And they have a steel band, you guys. It is so amazing. Like, I think I've seen one or two videos of them playing. And I told them when she told me that, I instantly... <laughs> was reminded of the show Gullah Gullah Island. I don't know why that just came to my head the minute she told me that they have a steel bed. So I'll, I'm going to see if she will play like a little something okay. something. She put one of them away. She needs a... <laughs> well, that's Janila in the background. Say hi Janila. You guys have seen Janila before. It's been so long. I haven't seen her ever. You just put the stuff away. So yeah, I'm going to get to see her. But yes, Coretta is, how old are you now? 29. She is a whole 29 in these streets, y'all. A whole 29. I remember 29. What was I doing? Having a baby. That's what I was doing. With it. Don't you do that. Having a child when I was 29 is what I did. I don't know how these things work. They're trying to get it together, y'all. But you know, she don't play something. You want to tell the people who you are, even though I kind of already did that. <laughs> yes, um, I'm Coretta Russell. I am 29. I just turned 29 today. Um, yeah, I wrote a song a while back. So oh, play it for us. Yes, yes, yes.
That was awesome. I don't know how to play none of this stuff, y'all. So, <laughs> y'all ain't about to get that. Now, how long have you guys been playing, Janela? Ooh, okay. So, I learned mm -hmm. when I was six. And I am, how old am I? 27. So, about. Wait a minute. She's older than you? Oh, absolutely. I did not know that. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, I've been playing about 21 years. And then, I think Coretta started playing maybe two three years after me so yeah uh, going on 20 years for her and I think the cool thing about her instrument she's like the rhythm guitar I play the bass and my brother plays like the melodies and higher harmonies so I like having her on every gig because she's the meat of <laughs> the band now what is the name of you guys band? the gratitude steel band and it is you and my whole family my parents my brother my sister who you just heard yes well thank you so much for playing again i don't know any of these instruments mm -hmm. I, I thought all steel bands or steel drums what are they called steel drums right? steel drums. okay i thought they all were the same but apparently they're not mm -hmm. do they have different names yes Okay, and what is this one called? This is got the steel drum guitars. Oh, okay. And you get, um, so these are the double ones, and then in Trinidad, you go from doubles up to a triple. Oh, see, I, you learn something new every day. Because <laughs> I didn't know that. Everything I see, they usually, I guess they like different shapes, I guess the way they make them. Mm -hmm. But I just thought they were all the same. You learn something new every day. See, Wave Trains, you come to my channel, you learn something new every day, okay? But yes, we're about to chill and relax because it's her birthday and I don't know what we're about to do because Janila drove me out the house. So I was walking in the night time. It's like almost 2 in the morning. Yeah. We out here because we was hanging. It's 125. We out here in the dark. Y'all can't see us. But you can hear us. I know. <laughs> It's very peaceful. It's very peaceful. It is. It is. But I'm glad I got out the house because y'all know I wasn't doing nothing but uh, watching uh, Netflix <laughs> and YouTube because that's what I do. Janela said, no, you're going to come out the house today. The there we go. All look like I'm seeing a scary movie now. <laughs> we do. This is dark and so we're not. It was <laughs> raining. It is like super foggy out here, y'all. So it's like for real creepy. And there's people walking behind us. They're coming from oh, okay. their local establishment. establishments. Establishments. <laughs> They're we being just, smart. Walking. That's good. Be responsible, people. We don't have far to go. We just gotta walk around the corner to get to the car. Y'all. So yes. I'm gonna go home and relax and make myself go to sleep. I'll probably be up for about another hour. But I have nothing to do tomorrow, so. Step out. Huh. They got raindrop. They hit me in my head. I ain't got no hair. Sometimes I'll be out late and I'll be like, where is y'all going? <laughs> where, where, where are you going at 125 in the morning? Where are you speeding? Exactly. Like, why do you have to speed? There's nobody else on the road. Literally. I see that? Nobody. Life is green today. <laughs> rain today. I have nowhere to go. But we're about to get in the car. We're about to go home. Mm -hmm. Janela's going to go home. She has a busy day tomorrow. I'm like, I don't think I have to do is fold clothes. <laughs> so yeah, well, thank you guys so much for watching. I'ma end this on this uh, note. Like I'm about to tell y'all a scary story. Oh. But <laughs> thank you so much for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. <laughs> thank you for enjoying Vlogtober Day Six. And I will see you when I see you in a minute.